Hello, welcome back to Nantenia's Daedric Artifacts. Today, we're going to get the Wobbajack. I wanted to record and upload this video previous uh, Saturday, but I had a ser I had a very serious case of the losing my voice. Yep, I still have a somewhat of a cold, but I can talk and record again. So let's do this. So this guy uh, basically says that his master has been lost, and we're going to help him. We're, we're in solitude, by the way, if you couldn't tell. So, so now we have Pelagius, uh, Pelagius's hip bone, which we got from this man who doesn't really appear to be extremely with it, shall we say? Hello. Just maybe you need a. Oh, I get in trouble for that. It's not allowed. Well, I suppose in that case it's okay to let you in. But only yeah, briefly. that's how things works in palaces. People just just go to someone and say, "Oh yeah, the supervisor told me it was all right," and that will be enough. So now we have access to this wing. All of a sudden, we're somewhere else, and we have been dressed in party clothing. Goes right through me. Besides, I have so many things to do. I really love his outfit. This guy is just a riot. The voice actor did put in a lot of effort. I can appreciate that. A lot of times in these Elder Scrolls games, <laughs> you can just hear the, the same voice actor over and over again. I do know I've heard this voice actor before in this game, but he tried to put on a different voice, a different accent even, so that's nice. Okay, um, so right now we're inside the head of uh, Emperor Pelagius. Oh, he, he was just about to say that. Pelagius the Third. That's right. You're in the head of a dead hump. I apologize. Something went wrong with my head, recording. But, but here we are again. Okay, so basically we are in uh, the head of um, the late Emperor Pelagius the Third, and he was mad, and now we have to help him again. So, Pelagius the Tormented. We received this Wobbajack, which can apparently, well, it has a random effect. So. Now there is a wolf tormenting his dreams, who turned into a goat, who turned into a goat. Uh, okay, so that was the thing he was having a nightmare of, and now it's innocent again. Okay, so he's being attacked by a bandit, and instead it's just a little child. He's also being plagued by... A witch was now turned into a sultry maiden. Oh dear. Okay. Did anything happen? Oh. That'll be it. something to crow about. With Pelagius up and about, you're moving right along. We'll both be home in no time. Pumpernickel. Yeah. The deepest, keenest hatred was The attacks he makes on himself can be seen here fully. They're always carried out on the weakest part of his fractions. The self-loathing enhances Pelagius' anger. Ah. But his confidence will shrink with every hit. You must bring the two into balance. Okay, so the problem is... Whoa, good grief. His confidence needs to be strong enough to overcome all of his anger and self-doubt and... Yeah, more self-doubt. So to do that, we are just going to make his anger smaller and make him bigger. Pelagius' mother was, well, let us say, unique. Oh, dear. Although I suppose, in the grand scheme of things, she was fairly average for a septum. That woman wielded fear like a cleaver. Or did she wield a cleaver and make people afraid? I never forget that part right. 
Okay, so we have these Atronox fighting each other. And come from anywhere at any time. Delivered. Nothing really happens. The objective here is simple, yes, simple Use your Waba job to defeat the enemy. Well, they do the same. Okay, so we have to defeat the enemy. The catch is. I remember there being a catch. Oh, I thought you'd never figure it out. Oh, there we go. After having boosted his confidence, gotten rid of his uh, feeling of threat and his uh, torments, we have saved the mind of a dead late emperor, which is good. So now we talk to Shiogareth again. Hmm. Fixed is such a subject. <laughs> I think treated is far more appropriate, don't you? Like the... I hope he lets us go after this monologue. To the shivering aisles. A truck. Luggage. Now where did I leave my luggage? Don't. Please don't stall. Master, you've taken ah, and here's this guy this again. Me. As for you, a little mortal minion. Feel free to keep I'm not a minion. Okay, and now we're back in solitude. Uh, still wearing party clothing, but now we have this, the Wobbajack, and a blast from it will have an unpredictable effect. It's really not that very great or interesting because it isn't reliable whatsoever. Still, it's a Daedric artifact, and that's one more for the collection. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time.